Ei shalom, shalom is a first of all, call Allah, the Yahweh, Basham, Yahushai, Basham, Kodash. Peace, blessing, salutation to the Ali Akimism. And I was on a Bible, his preaching and teaching his word in sincerity and in truth. You know, we do this lesson basically for, for um, edify the potential, like, as well as to proclaim judgment on the society, you know what I mean, and, and on two thirds of our people, and the heathen nation, man. All right? Um, you know? Uh, you know, as well as as we said before, to put, um, to edify the 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 potential elect of the nation of Israel, man, right? Because you people, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Hispanics, you know, Native American Indians are are um, the biblical Israelite. You know, the scriptures speak of man, right? Sin. So this script, this um, this scripture, this article, you know, is from um. Our health minister, right, Christopher Tufton, All right, and it, it entitles, This is Good News. Tufton welcomes AstraZeneca. It's like him. Uh, Maxine approval. All right. It's a uh, health minister, uh, Dr. Christopher Tufton, has described. Um, as good news, the World Health Organization authorization of two versions of the AstraZeneca right, um, Oxford C-19 vaccine for emergency use. The statement on Monday, February 15, in a statement on Monday, February 15, the UN Health Agency said it was Authorizing the AstraZeneca vaccines made by um, it's like a, made by the Serum, all right, Institute of India and South Korea, AstraZeneca SK Bio, giving a green light, all right, for three, for it's like a, for these vaccines to be rolled out globally through Covax, right, and Christopher Tufton statement. Is that this is good news for us, a country as we, um, for us as a country, right, as we move closer to introducing, to the introduction of vaccines in the island, right, as part of our C nineteen response, right, we can now further seek out other sources. That have been sent that have these approved vaccine available even as we anticipate the arrival of some doses of the c nineteen uh vaccine in uh, manufactured by AstraZeneca right in the coming weeks through the Covax um facilities tough than said all right um I'm just finish the article and we're just going to some scriptures, man, because we'll just show you the the country, right, to wherein our leaders, man, you know, the mindset of our leaders is in line with the mindset of our enemies, man. Who is our enemy? The so-called white man. Who is Edom, Hisa, right? That's his biblical name, man. And if you know anything about history, man, your own history and his history, Right, you would see that look, this man of a track record, a bloody track record, a trail of blood following him, man. And this man is your enemy, the main enemy of Israel, man. Alright? But our leaders hand in hand through greed, alright? And through lack of knowledge, man, and through disregard for the laws and statutes of the Bashim Shai, which is our Lord and Savior, man. Alright? To total disregard for his laws and his statutes, you know what I mean? And for even the people. These men are willing to sacrifice you people, man. Alright? And speaking about good news. Alright? So it's a, let's continue. Then we're just jumping at some scripture. We're going to show you what's the real good news, man. So it's a, the Kovacs C19. <laughs> it's like a... It's like a 
global access facilities bring together governments, um, global health organizations, manufacturers, scientists, private sectors, civil, ser- civil societies, and philanthropy to provide innovative and um, equitable access to, to C19 vaccine. Vaccinations has proven an unde- uh, undeniable success in the public health toolkit to uh, reduce the burden of infectious diseases in Jamaica as well as globally. Immunization, the, uh, the process by which persons become protected against a disease through vaccination has proved, proven to be one of the most successful <laughs> and cost-effective health interventions ever. Tough than had it. Yeah, even though them them load your your, your body with all type of chemical man. Uh, mercury and all and all of these things. So Christopher Tufton is saying that look, this is good news, right? Good news for Jamaica, you know what I mean, and good news for the world at large, alright? So let us see according to the Lord how about Shem Shai. What's the good news? This is Isaiah 61 and verse 1. So it's the spirit of the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Shai, is upon me because he hath anointed me, right, to preach good tidings, right, unto the meek. Right? And when you go in the word tidings, it's go back to, to news and uh, an announcement, a news rather. Right? So good tidings, right, that is the good news. He's speaking about good news right here. So we're gonna go down show you what really is a good news man because in 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 um the, the days of the prophets which were before speaking about Isaiah and all of these prophets man when a prophet come on the scene to speak news to the people right it was normally good news to them do you understand but to the righteous men right it was always good news man see in our evil society no you see the prophets and the highways and the byways. Man. Out here in Jamaica, we have James preaching and speaking the good news. But to, to the masses of the people, it is not good news, man. Right? And to these wicked governments, it's not good news, man. Because guess what? It's against their plans. And in society, the scripture says, the, 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 the prophets that have been before prophesy against kingdoms and great nations, man, of war and pestilence. See? And this is what we're doing in this dispensation of time. Right? We're telling you that, look, your people, all people have been deceived. Right? Ultimately, by um, the, the, the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Yashaya, put that, that, that spirit on Esau to deceive our people. See? Right? With all of these vaccination and and, 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 and and ultimately the RFID microchip, man, you can see which part. Um, the whole um, the RFID microchip is the mark of the beast. You know what I mean? And you can see which part our leaders are going to ease our people, take the time for ease our people into this, um, um, into taking this chip. All right. All right. So continuing, it's a. Um. Good tidings to the meek, right? He had sent me to bind up the broken hearts, right? That is us, man, right? Speaking about us coming back to this truth. To bind up the broken hearts, to proclaim liberty to the captives, all right? Speaking about us, to op- the, to the, um, and the opening of the prisons to them that are bound, right? And the, and the opening start within the mind, all right? The opening start within the mind because you have to be free in mind, you know what I mean, to realize that you, you have been bound for 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 for, um, for, the, for years. You're bound by a lack of knowledge, lack of understanding, you know what I mean? The, the main thing to free your mind, man, is this word, this truth, knowledge, and this understanding, man. See? So we've been bound for years. We've been dead for years, man. See? So now our mind has been freed up. Now we we know that Yahweh Yahweh Shai is coming in to, to 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 physically free and loose us loose us out of this captivity. And that's what we're waiting on, man. To proclaim 
verse 2, to proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord and the day of vengeance of our power. Right? To comfort all that mourn. All right? So, that's the good news, man. All right? To proclaim liberty to the captives, man. To free up the captives. Right? The opening of the prison. You know what I mean? The mines. I mean, to proclaim the acceptable year of the vengeance of the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Shai, right? And to our power, right? To comfort all that mourn. And we are the one that mourning, man. So we all the and the Irish and the Bible is preaching and telling that this kingdom is going to be destroyed. That is the good news. To proclaim the acceptable year of the vengeance, God. This is the time of the Lord vengeance, man. All right? The scripture says, Oh, my people, make ye ready to the battle. All right? See, there is a war coming, man, both spiritual and physical, man. All right? And your minds have to be prepared, and your leader is supposed to be the one that's preparing you and telling you, because they are at the, 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 the top, right? Under the, the, these, these powerful men, we are controlling them, right? They're supposed to be, they're supposed to have more information coming to you people man about what's going on in the world in terms of geopolitics and, and, and certain wars that is that's been brewing because you people not 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 um you people not research these things. See? So your leaders are responsible for tell you and edify you on these things if they are righteous leaders man. Alright? Which bring me to the next scripture. Ecclesiastes 10 verse 1 A wise judge will instruct his people and the government of a prudent man is well ordered. Right? A wise judge will instruct his people. These, our judges are not wise. But our judges are puppet um, for he saw. As the judge of the people is himself, is himself, so are his officers. And what manner of man the ruler of a city is, such are all they that dwell therein. An unwise king destroyed his people, but through the prudence of, a, um, of them which are in authority, the city shall be inhabited. Right? And look, the scripture in um, Isaiah, um, I believe it's one or two, you speak of, um, uh, <clears throat> it's a lot of restore thy judges as at the first man, right? Um, and I counsel us as at the beginning for the powerful scripture. Alright. And thou shalt be called what? Then thou shalt be called the city of righteousness. Alright, that, that, that faithful city. But I not before the Lord do these things, man. But after the Lord had done these things, then the city, right, which is New Jerusalem, right? The elect of the nation of Israel. Right? That's the well ordered, and that's the judges, right, um, in their specific orders, all right? And through those men, all right, through that elect, the nation of Israel are going to come back, man, and it's going to be well ordered, you know what I mean? It's going to be a righteous city, man, and that's what we, we that's that, that is a part of the good news, the vengeance, all right? See, the, 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 the the destruction what the Lord will bring upon the society, upon the wicked, the punishment um, of the wicked, you know what I mean? And, and looking forward right, to a righteous city in the end, a righteous place, man, where we can dwell in peace. But if we worry about people trying to vaccine, um, vaccinate our kids, see, we can't even say the real word, you know what I mean? Our, our fear, our, our, um, you know, these videos not going up, you know, but we need to edify. You know, the, the, the potential, you know what I mean? So that's why we kind of code it up, man. See? You know? But we need a place, man, where we can, we can, we can praise, you know, the Lord, the Hawa Bashim El Shai, man. You know? Without even fear. See? Alright, so it's, it's, um, this is, so we go back to verse 3, Isaiah 61, verse 3, so to appoint. And to them that mourn in Zion, in Zion, all right, that's key thing, and to give unto them beautiful ashes, all right, 
because you know when we um in Asia and Israel when you mourn, you know you throw ashes, you know on your head, you know what I mean um and basically you 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 rent your clothes, you rip your clothes, man. So you know we're not gonna mourn no more, man. That's, that was a sign of humbling yourself. I've been humble, you know. Um, we're not gonna mourn no more. So you know, the scripture say, oh, yeah, basically what it's saying you know, is that the Lord will take away all of these things, man. Right? And give unto them beauty for ashes, the oil of joy for mourning, and garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. All right? That they might be called trees of righteousness, the planting of the Lord, that they might be glorified. All right, with that one to call Allah the Hawa Bashem and Hawa Shai Bashem Akal Kudash. The Bahanas to the elders and apostles of Great Mastone. Shalom to you, I, um, brothers and I was on the byways preaching this word in society, in sincerity, and in church.